Hello everyone. My name is Aisha Aslam Ahmed from Bright Rider School, Grade 4. Today, I'm going to do the Anok STEM at Home Digital Twin Oil Rig Challenge. So let's start our platform or offshore drilling rig is a large structure with facilities for well drilling to explore extract store and process petroleum and natural gas that lies in rock formations beneath the seabed many oil platforms will also contain facilities to accommodate their workforce what are the parts of an oil rig the parts of an oil rig are crown, block and water table, cat line boom and hoist line, drilling line, monkey board, traveling block, top drive, mast and drill pipe. Now I am going to show you some of the largest oil rigs in the world. First is the Bergut. The Bergut, the Bergut oil platform is the largest in the world, weighing over 2,100 tons. It's located in the Shaklin 1 oil field of the Russian Pacific coast. Second is the Stones. Stones is the world's deepest oil and gas project operating in around 2,900 meters, that is 9,500 feet of water in an ultra-deep area of the U.S. Gulf of Mexico. The FPSO connects to subsea infrastructure which produces oil and gas from reservoirs nearly 30,000 feet below sea level. Next is the Perdido. Perdido is the deepest floating oil platform in the world at a water depth of about 2,450 meters operated by the Shell Oil Company in the Gulf of Mexico, USA. The Perdido is located in the Perdido Fold Belt, which is a rich discovery of crude oil and natural gas that lies in water that is nearly 8,000 feet deep. Now is the Hibernia. Hibernia is an oil field in the North Atlantic Ocean, across approximately 315 kilometers east southeast of St. John's, Newfoundland, Canada, in 80 meters of water. And last is the Petronius. Petronius is a deep water complement tower oil platform built from 1997 to 2000 and operated by Cheverin in the Gulf of Mexico, 210 kilometers southeast of New Orleans, United States. Now I'm going to take you through my Minecraft oil rig. In my oil rig, there is the drilling area oil tank storage area, bedroom, washroom, dining and meeting room, manager's office, crane area, helipad area and cruise ship area. So this is my oil rig from outside. Let me go inside and show you. So we are going to start from this part first. This is the entrance. Then here is the drilling area. As you can see, there are two large structures and a hole used for the drilling. And then over here is the oil tank storage area. Here the refined oil is stored. This area is the working area. The crew members can work over here. It's divided into four parts. Next, with the elevator, we can go up to the second floor. The second floor has one building divided into three parts. So the first part has the bedroom. As you can see, I wanted to arrange it in the colorful order. So I arranged the beds in the rainbow order. This is the bedroom. 
and then here the other two buildings entrance is from the other side so the second building has the washrooms there are two washrooms one here and one on the other side as well now the third building it has the meeting and dining room as you can see here is the table and here are the seats then the third floor it has the manager's office let's see so over here is the entrance here is the manager's office there is a chair table and another two extra chairs and some books and if you go behind the manager's office then you will see the crane so going up you can see the room where you can control the crane it's a small one with some buttons and here is the crane it's throwing out a chain in the water now again if you go down here then there'll be something else also to the ground floor over here now we are going to part b so first in this chest is the pp items there's a diamond helmet chest plate leggings boots along with a shield and a diamond pickaxe now here is the helipad and then when you go down here is the here are two tanks filled with crude oil now this is a box filled with crude crude oil taken some days ago and as you can see this box is a little above the sea that indicates that the crude oil has been taken a few minutes ago and this one is still discovering for some crude oil now this area is the cruise ship area it's the last one so as you can see there are two seats here and two seats in the other side and then again if you go up another there's a one seat and the second seat and now over here is the captain's area there are two seats and here's the view so this was my all rig i thank adnock for giving me an opportunity for learning something new i'm heading for my next challenge bye